Hey guys, it's the Cichlid Corner. So guys, um, I've been thinking of starting a series of cichlids because some of you guys own cichlids and if you guys want me to continue doing this, just tell me in the comment section below. So, these are all my cichlids, seven of them in a 10 gallon tank. So you guys might be thinking, that is bad, you need a 55 gallon. Yes, I know, I know you guys. Don't think I'm a dummy. So, don't think I'm a fish dummy on cichlids. So, yes, I do know they need a big tank. And also, you guys, the reason why I keep them in a 10 gallon is not because I want it. It's because my dad thinks that, because he has a fish expert, like, friend. He thinks that they say, he, his expert friend told him, that it's okay to keep cichlids in a 10 gallon tank if there's only seven. And if there's 15, then you keep them in a 20. That's what my, his friend said. And I really don't believe that. Some of you guys don't believe that. It's like, wow. It's like, you gotta know the truth and everything. And I already know, but it's just that my, I'm like, we should up, upgrade our tank soon it's like no it's okay they're fine but honestly i will upgrade this tank and honestly i don't believe his friend it's like really no that's a lie so yeah so my cichlids have already eaten this is what i feed them um cichlid pellets from aquion Very good size and everything. So yeah, they're up there. So today is actually not gonna be about my goldfish, but they're gonna be about these beautiful cichlids. So yeah, I never really have done, I really never paid attention, but my goldfish are over there. They're doing great in their 20 gallon. Everything, so yeah. Um, let's see what they have inside. So, from the outside actually, they have this marina. Um, this marina of thermometer. And obviously a thermometer, a thermometer tells you, like, um, what's it called, like how the temperature is. And, um, you guys, I'm actually not an cichlid expert, but I just want to know, you guys, if cichlids need a heater. I do have a heater, but I don't use it in this tank, and it's a big one, and everything. Sorry about what you heard right now. My vase fell down, so, yeah. Okay, so, you guys, um, yeah, I don't know if you guys, if cichlids need heaters, I do have one, but it's big, probably for a 29 gallon, because it came with the 29 gallon over there. And you guys, um, I'm gonna go show you my 29 for a second. So here's my 29 gallon, and you guys see my black moors. So my black moors, I did not turn them in yet, and I will be turning them in, because I just, like, I'm sorry, but they don't look too good. So, yeah. I'm going to get my money back or in exchange. But I think I'm just going to get my money back and go to PetSmart instead. Or just go to my local fish store. So, yeah. Pretty much it for the Black Moors. So, this is what I have. All these things. I have some glitter. Okay. Um... I have Melafix, Pemafix, or Pemafix, I don't know. I got some regular water conditioner, some aquarium stuff, um, an extra filter, an air pump, extra 
not good quality pellets. It's like this box. And here's the heater. I, oops, sorry. Okay. Honestly, you guys, I do not know how to work the heater. Literally, I don't know how to use it, so I really never used it. So this is it. The thing that I only know is to leave it in the tank sitting for a while. But I don't know. So you guys tell me if I need it for cichlids. Where I live, it's like around 68 Fahrenheit to 80 to 90, but it, it kind of gets warm, so I'd say it's 70 degrees in the house. In my tank um, degrees, it's like 70 something, around 70. So I don't know if I should use this or not. It came, like I said, with the tank. It like, came like that it was supposed to go in but I didn't use it because goldfish don't need heaters unless you live somewhere cold so yeah I don't know you guys tell me if I need a heater for cichlids so yeah so I have some black petco sand in there um I got um I don't know what the cichlid breed is called I think it's like a yellow and a yellow electric African cichlid I think or something like that I don't know but um you guys probably know if you're you keep cichlids so yeah tell me if you know I got two plants um one I got from PetSmart and one I got from Petco and I have some rocks right here and pretty much it for the cichlid tank. They have their filter cartridge and yeah they don't have a, they have a hood in my storage room but the light bulbs don't work so I need to get them soon but really this is super old trust me I got this like in 2000 something I don't know but like it's really old so yeah that's why you can hear it a little bit more than that one over there so yeah and it's like rusty like my hood is really rusty and it's old so I'm guessing I'm hoping that I can get a new hood either or just I don't know clean my other one out but it's really cool trust me so I do know basic care for cichlids so don't think I don't know anything about them and I shouldn't be taking care of them I do know because I study fish like you know tropical fish cichlids and goldfish mostly so yeah pretty much it oh and this is just a tiny update on my goldfish so um they're doing pretty good actually and um, no signs of sickness. They're, they're doing better, actually. I think they already have been cured. And they look all healthy and happy and everything. So I'm happy that they're happy, you know, because they're not feeling sick or anything. So pretty much for my goldfish, they're doing great, and I'm happy once again. So what I use on my cichlids and my all my fish, I use some ammonia detoxifier and I use some stress coat and some prime that's all and sometimes I use this or my other one of these that are just like regular ones so yeah I use this and I use some sand sometimes and these work really great because the reason I use this is because Ammonia builds up sometimes, and then your fish can die of ammonia. So I usually use that to prevent it. So thank you guys for watching. Comment and subscribe today. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to spread the word about how unique and beautiful these fish I have really are. And don't forget to spread the word about my channel. Bye, guys.